In this video, I'm going to be releasing my render and recording settings. I'll show you how to make your videos look exactly like mine, how to get to motion blur and stuff. Um, I'm doing this because I have 25k subscribers, so thank you all so much. Let's get to 30k and get YouTube rank on Hypixel. So as you can see, I use OBS to record and I use version 25.08.8 and this is just the least laggy version for me. So I recommend installing that one. And I use game capture to record, so yeah, you can choose that one or display capture if the game capture lags too much. It really depends on your PC. Also, now that I'm speaking of lag, this is not good for uh, low-end PCs like if you're playing on your mom's laptop. I only recommend these exact settings if you get like 500 FPS in Minecraft when you're not recording. Um, you can also, as you can see, I recorded in 240 FPS. You can also change it to 120, but if you want to go for 60, I recommend different settings. If you really want to, I can make a separate video on that, but I don't recommend these settings if you have a bad PC. Some other things you can do is run OBS in admin mode and also disable preview. It's now black for me, but this might also lag your uh, recording. And one last thing is if you want to see this, you can go to view docs and check stats. Like this, you can just see if it's lagging or not. Okay, so now let's go into settings, go to output, make sure this is on advanced and go to recording. Then choose a recording pad. I save it on an SSD and I do this because otherwise my recording lags again. Um, yeah, if I save it on my hard drive, the FPS will drop like crazy and it's not good. So I recommend saving it on an SSD if you, at least if you have these high recording settings. Change the recording format to MP4, encoded to NVIDIA NVENC. This is just the best for performance. If you have to choose X264, this will make your um, recording lag like crazy. So I don't recommend these recording settings again if you don't have an NVIDIA card. Choose CQ and make sure your CQ level is on 16. You can play around with this for a bit, choose what's the least laggy for you. Make sure this is on max quality and pr profile on high and check these two and select two B frames. Go to video and choose a fractional FPS value. Make sure this is 240 if you want 240 FPS and this is just one from default I guess. If it lags, again <laughs> you can change it to 120 like this if you really want to. I record in 240 so I get a motion blur and also if I slow down my video it will still look 60. FPS. 120 FPS will also make it to get motion blur but just a little bit less and make sure these two are on 1080p and I don't think this really matters uh, maybe if it lags try another one uh, make sure the process priority is on above normal color space on 709 and color range on full these two will just make your video look like more colorful okay so now let's get into the Vegas settings okay so we're in Vegas now first I'm going to show the project settings so like you can copy everything here but the most important things are these ones, make sure this is on Gaussian, blend fields and smart resample. When you're editing, um, it doesn't really matter what these are, but when you are going to render it, make sure this is on smart resample because this is the motion blur. It will basically make the 240 FPS that I record in into uh, 60 FPS and it will like make these four frames blend into one. So it looks higher FPS on YouTube because YouTube only allows 60 FPS. So when you render it, make sure to select all your clips, go to Magix AVC AAC and I have some templates here. Just select any one of these and click customize template and then copy my settings this is the one i normally use and just make sure the frame size is on 1440p and this is just so you get a better encoder on youtube because when it's 1080p it will choose like a bad encoder and your video will literally look trash on youtube so i recommend 1440p or 4k even if you really want that change this to high 60 fps um yeah just copy everything here make sure the bitrate is on 240 million encoding mode nv encoder if you don't have an nvidia card then just select this one i guess high quality and vbr high quality uh, copy these audio settings and make sure this is best then you can give it the name and click the save icon so you can just click it and have the renders so when you render this this will look exactly like my videos i hope you enjoyed make sure to leave a like subscribe it is helped you if you have any questions make sure to ask me in the comments i will try to reply to every question you have i hope i can see you all next time bye